what about when people are on the fence? Like they're like, oh, that's interesting. Like, mm, I don't know if I have money or, or they have hesitations. Like then how do you push when you're like, oh, this person's like a maybe, they already know the offer, they see the value, like then what? Yeah. So money and time are the biggest objections we get for everything, right? And when we think about it, the way the way that I kind of start to think about it is there's finite money, there's finite time. But yet there is money and there is time. So it is where is that money and where is that time going? If the money and the time isn't going, if, you know, Kim, if you and I are on a sales call and you're asking about money or time, your money or time is going to go to something. It might not even be a competitor of mine. It might be a target trip that you need to make, right? And so my job is to build the value of why giving me your money and time is going to exponentially be better for you than giving it to the target run or, you know, the extra things that maybe we think we need, but we don't. And so it's really peeling back the layers of the onion. When somebody says, I don't have time, I just like to say, oh, you don't have time. Tell me a little bit more about that and get a little bit deeper because they're almost always masking something else, even money. I can help you see like if if we can put this money here, here's how the money will multiply. Here's how we can do that.